Down strike to Tommy Streeter. Tied up the game at seven apiece, and then the touchdown from Lamar Miller. And as coach mentioned, not much on the ground for Miami in that first half as Travis Benjamin is back for the U. Sven Hurd lets it go. Benjamin inside of the 10. Has some room along the sidelines. Travis Benjamin with a good return out across the 40 yard line. Damage in terms of yardage. Over 100 yards passing in the first half. We'll go to Benjamin to try to pick up some more. Benjamin surveys after he picks up the first down. Nearly got the ball knocked from behind. Ryan Davis came from behind to try to knock that one loose. But... Ja'Cory Harris without an interception so far today. He's had an interception in six consecutive games. Here's Lamar number Miller six. Has had Lamar over 100 yards rushing in each of his first three games this season. Four on that play to set up second and six. Blitz being shown by Bethune Cookman. A pitch. Miller got a good block and has a seam. Lamar Miller to the house. 43 yard touchdown. Simple pitch play out here to the left hand side. Pulling around. Great execution. Bethune Cookman playing a lot of man, don't have a lot of guys deep. That's why they're susceptible to the post throw earlier in the first half and the run around the end with nobody secondarily to help them. Two score lead for Miami. Right out of the gates, off the blocks, hot here in the second half. Coach said it, 19 yards rushing in the first half. Miami needs something on the ground. This is what they got, a 43-yard run from Lamar Miller. Second touchdown of the day. Set to kick off. Kickoff coverage for Miami, 10th in the country. Cabrera inside his own five. Nowhere to go. Short return. Casey Last Rogers season. was there. Bethune Cookman had to replace a great quarterback in Matt Johnson. One of the top quarterbacks in the MEAC last year. It was an open race between Wilson and Robinson. Jordan Murphy, the tight end, with a first down catch. That's his third catch of the day. He and Maurice Francois and Eddie Poole with three catches apiece. A dozen completions for Jackie Wilson. First and ten from just past the 30 yard line. Rodney Scott. 22 yards rushing for number 22 in the first half. He'll pick up a couple as Jojo Nicholas does a lot of damage on the ground. As he faces a second and eight. Quick throw to Jonathan Moman, the fullback. Hit shy of the 40 yard line by Jimmy Gaines. This is before Maryland, before Danny O'Brien, who's been one of the best quarterbacks in the ACC, really came on last year. Third and three for Wilson. And Maurice Francois and Travis Benjamin back to return this Corey Kowalski kick. Let's hope Corey got a reinforcement of where to punt the ball. Kind of a rugby style kick. We've seen him actually run out of a punt formation this year. This one will be down to the 32 yard line. Corey Harris with pressure from behind, but Harris gets a couple of blocks Sandlins. of any Bethune Cookman player on this roster. Reggie Sandlins, his 14th career start. Lamar Miller, close to the 35 yard line. Just over 10 minutes to go here in the third quarter. Bethune Cookman took a 7 0 lead, 21 unanswered from Miami. Third and eight for the Hurricanes. First down catch. Ball comes loose. Daniel Rhodes ends up with a football in his hands. Jumped in. 
Good job, fine. I just thought Clive was just a little casual right here. Doesn't really see that ball in, doesn't tuck it away. You need to grab that thing like it's a big bag of money and hold on to it. I just thought he was too casual. Coach mentioned during the week he wanted to get him the football because he is so well athletic. But... And Bethune Cookman at the Miami 45. Jackie Wilson to throw on first down. Able to connect with Anthony Jordan. Been there. Bethune Cookman has taken advantage of it. We'll see if Miami counters with a squat in the corner in the flat here. Wilson goes right back to it. Andronicus Lovitz. A few yards shy of the first down. Chicolo there again for the step. Lyman making a play down the field like that. That shows a lot about his heart and his motor. Bethune, 41% on third down this season. They're 5 for 11 today. They need just three. Wilson fires for it, and he's got the first down to Eddie Poole. His top target with a six-yard pickup on his fourth catch of the day. No work from the 32. Gene Desson off the line. Wilson will throw. He's looking for Poole. And he had at least a foot in bounds. a missed field goal in the red zone today. Right cornerback for the Hurricanes, Mike Williams, limping off the field. We'll see if Bethune Cookman wants to take advantage of that personnel matchup. And Thomas Finney, the freshman, is in at quarterback. Jackie Wilson has time, checks down. Jordan inside of the 10, puts his shoulder down near the first down marker. He's been little used. Nine carries on the season coming in. But he's got a couple of touchdowns. He's made the most of his opportunities. Bethune trying to make the most of this red zone chance. Third and one. Wilson will pitch it. Here comes Jordan. Telemac made the initial contact, and Miami will make the stop. We've seen a missed field goal in the red zone today from 38. Bethune is going to go for it on fourth and two. Jordan trying to dive ahead. This may depend on the spot at the bottom of that pile. One-on-one. -on -one. It's Mike Williams out there. See if they give him a chance. Top of your screen. Francois in motion on first and goal. Wilson will keep it. Wilson spun into the end zone for a touchdown. Start of the season for Wilson. The seventh of his career. Sven Hurd puts it through. And it's a one-score game. Miami made a statement to start this second half with a quick touchdown. But how about the Wildcats and Jackie Wilson, his first start of the season, bringing the Wildcats back within seven. Brian Jenkins Bethune with a very impressive going. answer. Nine play, 45-yard drive after the turnover from Miami. And this is why Al Golden has put so much emphasis on ball security. Bethune-Cookman able to take advantage. Travis Benjamin from the 10. Benjamin's got some room. Looking for a seam. A good play for Bethune Cookman Arts for a touchdown. Ja'Cory Harris takes over for Miami up seven. Good return from Travis Benjamin. To start it at the 38 yard line. Lamar Miller, they've enjoyed this pitch play to Miller. He's had the touchdown in that long he got a touchdown. Bit antsy early on. He made a great play at the end, but probably could have stood in there just a little bit longer. He had decent protection. Excellent job, Travis Benjamin, coming back to the football. Ryan Lewis going after Ja'Cory Harris. Much more manageable situation, third and one. That pitch play to Miller again. Davis is in pursuit. Miller keeps it alive for a first down. Dragged out by Reggie Sandilands, and then a flag at the end of the play. Three tight end set here for Miami. They've done good things with these big packages. Harris, time to throw. Incomplete. He was looking for a senior from Williamsville, New York. Second down. And an eye formation here with Higgins in as Lamar Miller gets the handoff and he keeps it going across the 20 yard line inside of the Bethune Cookman red zone. Play fake to Miller. Pressure coming. And Harris gets rid of the football. Interception-prone quarterback in his career. 
without a pick today. Second and ten. They send Walford in motion. And a pitch to Miller. Lamar Miller. Over 100 yards rushing for the this year. seven times. So hopefully he can get some consistency going and develop that, that uh, effectiveness that they want. Trying to convert in the red zone on third and five. Roll to the right. And an incomplete pass. Now sweep to Kansas State on a goal line stand. Trying to work back to 500. A 30-yard attempt coming for Jake Wyclaw, who's made all three of his field goal attempts this season. From the left hash mark, he angles it right through. Let's get a three and out right here and make a statement. Lamar Miller had a rough go at it in the first half on the ground, but this was set up by a long punt return. This was in the second quarter. Lamar Miller on the pitch, and they like that pitch play. He turned it upfield pretty quickly to start this second half. 43-yard touchdown. I mean, a good scheme by Miami against man coverage. Angelo Cabrera with a foot in the end zone takes it out. Won't get to the 20. Great coverage from Miami. Let's go to some First and 15. Rodney Scott blocking out of the backfield. Wilson. Ajomo had the initial pressure. And he got plenty of help from Marcus. Boy, that was a pretty clear Ajomo face mask that did not get called. Second and 21. Scott, nowhere to go. Robinson, the initial coverage. Denzel Perriman came over to get the ball off. They need to get to the 26. Rodney Scott has to give Corey Kowalski a little bit of room as our third quarter comes to an end. Miami's look much better since that first quarter. A couple of good defensive stops for Miami in that third quarter. A 10-point hurricane lead. Bethune punts to start the fourth.